Wonderland Weekly is proud to present Cedar Point 2019. Now sit back and have a wonderful trip abroad. All right, everyone, I'm going to take you for a little bit of a walk around uh, Forbidden Frontier on Adventure Island, the uh, new attraction at Cedar Point for 2019. And uh, looks like we came on the right day. Apparently, it is, uh, they're, they're having a Truce Day celebration today from 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. Let's go check it out. I was a big fan of uh, Shoot the Rapids. I absolutely loved it. Um, so it's, it's, it's sad to me to see, you know, that it's gone, um, but, uh, but you know what? This is kind of a really nice repurposing of the, uh, the old station area. Yeah, I don't know. Lots of little props here there. Lots of little things. And, um... Ooh, visit provisions. I am probably actually going to do so. I'm going to get some food there. But, uh, yeah. This is, uh, this is looking interesting. Adventure Trail, Snake River Swamp, and the Fishing Bridge. Alright, let's, uh, get going on our journey. Crystal Rocks, Crystal Rock Wraps. Um, so it looks like it is a pole bridge, which is kind of interesting. Um, you just pull on the rope and it gets you from one side to the other. Um, kind of neat in concept, actually. I, 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 I don't know, I'm not, I, I feel like I'm not as against this as, as other people are. Um, but it does feel like it doesn't quite fit with Cedar Point. I love these bridges where they uh, adjust to your weight. Pontoon bridge, as it were. Really like it. These things, on the other hand, look kind of weird. They're like manufactured lily pads. So a little unfortunate here, the uh, uh, Cascade Falls pathway is closed. Uh, so I'm not sure quite why that is, but it looks like a really nice pathway and it should go like, you know, it should have some, uh, some water running, some, uh, some waterfalls. So, yeah, it's kind of disappointing. So for those of you who don't know, uh, Shoot the Rapids uh, opened in 2010 and uh, was removed only a few seasons later, like maybe like five years later. Uh, it was here when I came in 2014, it's gone now, but you can still see the remnants of it here on, what is it, Adventure Island? Frontier Island? I think it's Adventure Island. Um, but yeah, so, you know, you can see the trough for it, uh, and that was where one of the splash zones was. Interesting to see the remnants of it. All right, so we've arrived at the first uh, little building here. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but, uh, you know, we've got a nice little character out here. And... Chef was in some secret meeting about wood. We don't know. It's a secret. She went to Yeah. Hey, that does sound kind of shady, right? Secret meetings, right? Mm-hmm. Sounds awful shady. We're looking for a map thief right now. Somebody stole our treasure map. Oh. You want to help that's us with this? Good. Yeah, sure. Okay, good. Now, I want to find out who that secret meeting was with. Yeah. Okay. She ran from you? Yeah. Well, she's real good friends with Scotch Osborne. Maybe he knows. Scotch Osborne, funky looking fella. Yes, that's all blood and mismatch. <laughs> Will you ask him and see if he knows? Okay. There he is. All right. Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, last time I saw him, he was nearby Chester. Now, the map went missing around 1 o'clock this afternoon. Okay. You wouldn't mind going and asking everybody what they were doing at that time? For sure. All yeah. right. Start over at the shipwreck for me, would you? Okay. Down this path here, you take a left at the fork, go past the gypsy camp, you'll see the shipwreck there on the left. 
All right, sounds good. Oh, thank you. What's your name? Tyler. Tyler. Ed, nice to meet you. Good to meet you, too. Oh, thanks for your help. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, so we, uh, we have our assignment. Let's go. <laughs> Happy Truce Day. Take a paper. The Island Ledger. Treasure map stolen. Oh, dear. Commander Etta Fox calls for volunteers. Yeah, we're going to help her out. And, uh... Head all, all the way around. The elder is in. Elder is smarting us again. Yes, I'm gonna have to spot you. Just went to a secret meeting. The secret meeting was Thing that you have to like, you know, come around, ask questions, to a door that won't open. But during the discussion, a fight broke out! Jess and Captain Finch grabbed hold of the map! They tussled back and forth when finally the map gave way and ripped down the middle! Everyone could hear the terrible tear! Give me a tearing sound! Ah! Not, not a muscle, <laughs> a piece of paper. <laughs> and so, the feud between the two clans began. Would you go back to your places? Gypsy camp here. The feud continued for years until finally a cavalry officer was sent to intervene. This officer's name was Commander Edda Fox. And everyone could hear her scouts bugle as they crossed over. The bugle sound. <laughs> Commander Edda confiscated the ripped treasure map and hid it away in a locked box with the understanding that after five years of peace, the map could finally be resurrected. Passing year, the truce gained a foothold. Tensions eased. Members of the two clans began to shake hands and pat each other on the back. Go ahead, shake each other's hands, pat each other on the back. And uh, life went back clear. to normal here on Adventure Island. They, uh, they certainly did a lot of work here um, to make this all look uh, look like a, a, a real inhabited island. I do like it. It's just I don't have time for it. I I, I don't know. I'm, I'm sorry, Edda Fox, but I don't think I'm actually gonna figure things out. I'm not gonna find your treasure map. But still cool to uh, to see everything around. Well, out of there, folks. How's it going? Not batting yourself. Oh, I'm doing just fine. Well, almost as fine. Have you heard about our treasure map? Yes, I have. Yeah. So yeah. we're trying to figure out who did it, but uh, y'all got any suspicions? No, I don't, I don't yet. Do you do you uh, have any info? Well, I think it might be one of the fortune tellers. One of the fortune tellers. Yeah, oh. Naughty or Luca man you love. You see, she said there are dark things going to happen, and uh, suddenly they came true. I, that's a little convenient for me. Uh, also, some mainlanders, uh, just like you said, they, sh they saw her with the map. So oh, I don't wow. Know. Okay. This body is interesting, suspicious. All right. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll look into that. Right. Thanks. <laughs> Emus. Hello. Hello, little emu. Hello. Yeah, I don't think you'll be able to make it through the fence. Little emu. I'm going to try to not get too, too close. So as part of this whole uh, adventure, this uh, forbidden frontier, uh, they've got this area called High Ground, which is a giant play structure. I absolutely love this. Um, it's it's fantastic. Um, I would, man, I would love this as a kid. I don't know if I'm allowed to 
to go in it as an adult, they would probably look at me kind of funny if I tried. Oh well. Alright, closing thoughts here from Forbidden Frontier. Uh, I feel like that was supposed to be a waterfall uh, and it's not working anymore. Uh, you're not able to go back there for some reason. Um, these little TNT pump things uh, don't work very well if they work at all. Um, and it, yeah, I don't know. It says pump five to six times. Like I tried it and well, that one didn't do anything. This one like eventually worked that one. I, I don't know. I feel like things are like not working the way they should. Um, obviously, this thing is not this thing is not designed for me. But um, but even still, like it's if I had kids, I would enjoy like coming here with my kids. As a kid, I think I'd just go to the playground and enjoy that. <laughs> so um, you know, and if if I had a season pass, like like if this was my home park then I think that I, I could, you know, spend a day, like, looking into everything, but it, it, it feels like it takes a lot of time out of your day, and when you only have so much time, I'm not gonna worry about it. So, that's about it from uh, the Forbidden Frontier. I do not advise it, just stick to the rides. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like the video, comment with anything you'd like me to cover in the future, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and support me on Patreon so that I can visit more parks and create more wonderful videos.